Hey everybody, what's up and welcome back to my channel. So today I have a cooking video for you guys and I know you guys have been wanting this for such a long time. So I'm starting off my cooking series with one of my favorite recipes and it's actually just lo mein, but I found a way to make it low carb by using pasta that is made out of lentils. Now, there are many alternatives to pasta nowadays, so I'm gonna show you guys how I basically make this. It is all veggie based, there is no meat in this because the lentils are already such a great source of protein. It has 25 grams of protein per serving. So I'm gonna show you guys what you need and let's get cooking. So obviously the first thing you're gonna need is some noodles and I, I'm using the Pau Pasta Green Lentil Spaghetti. And for vegetables, I'm gonna be using baby Bella mushrooms, some bean sprouts, also some green onion, a head of broccoli, and some coleslaw. Now coleslaw is such an easy trick if you don't wanna sit there and shred cabbage, really easy. And then for seasonings, let me show you what I got. So for seasonings, I got some sambal oleg. I think that's how you pronounce it. It's chili paste, basically. Some soy sauce, some minced garlic. I have some of this stir-fry Szechuan stir-fry sauce. Ugh, I totally botched that. Don't know if I'm gonna use that. I'll let you know if I do. And then I also have some baby corn that should go with the vegetables. But let's get going. I'm just gonna be chopping this head of broccoli as normal. I mean, there's not a lot of chopping involved in this recipe. You could even use pre-chopped broccoli or frozen vegetables, which you guys know I love to use frozen veggies. And I'm just trying to show you guys some recipes that are easy to do and are also very, very healthy for you. So once I have my veggies all chopped up, I have the water going for the spaghetti right now, not the spaghetti, the pasta. Well, it is spaghetti, but I'm gonna throw that in right now and then we'll start cooking our veggies. All right, so now that I have all my veggies put together, I'm gonna go ahead and throw this on the stove. I'm gonna be sauteing it with just regular oil, ugh, regular old olive oil. You can use any oil you want, depending if you're on keto or whatever, but let's get these veggies grilling, not grilling, sauteing. So while the vegetables are sauteing, what you're gonna wanna do is add some of your soy sauce, some of your chili paste, and some of your minced garlic, and that's just gonna make sure that the flavor is also in the vegetables as well as in the chow mein. Why is this fly testing me right now? I just don't get it. I forgot the baby corns. Guys, so the final step is I'm just gonna be throwing in my pasta. It's all ready to go and I'll show you guys how it all comes together. All right guys, so here is my finished product. This is a veggie lo mein, like I said. I'll put the macros on the screen or down below. It looks so good. I can't wait to eat this. It's super healthy for you and I hope you guys enjoyed this recipe. Obviously, I wanna eat it, so let's try it on screen. That tastes exactly like lo mein. Like, you wouldn't be able to tell the difference. It's so, so good. Big thumbs up. Before I leave, I wanna remind you guys of something I've been promoting on my Instagram. I am hosting my first ever diet bet and it's gonna be so, super fun. It starts October 22nd, and basically diet bet is something where you bet $35 US dollars, and you have to lose 4% of your body weight. I'm gonna be along the way um, helping, giving more recipes like this, maybe posting some exclusive content. And if you lose 4% of your body weight, not only do you win your $35 back, you also get to split the pot of people that maybe didn't reach their goals, but we're sending positive vibes out there. The URL is dietbet.com slash Tina. I'll leave it down below. I'll leave it on the screen. And yeah, thank you guys so, so much for watching this video. I'm gonna go finish my lunch. I will see you guys in my next video. Please leave down below if you guys have any recipe requests and subscribe for more videos like this. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.